In recent times, motorists have been having hard times driving in Lagos owing to terrible potholes and bad state of roads across the state. The situation has practically affected businesses and other activities as well. This is just the tips of the iceberg of the road situations in Lagos from the mainland to the island. And this situation has not only affected vehicle owners, but pedestrians and residents are also suffering from the pains associated with our roads. It affects my car, it spoils my car, every time I do my car. In a week, sometimes in a month, I do my car. Because the bad will, the bad will affect the car, water will enter into the car. So the road will spoil my car. So we find solution about this our road. What we are passing through in Lagos uh, nowadays uh, is very, very tough uh, because of road. All routes in Lagos are very bad. And we all know as a driver, as a road user, we face a lot concerning traffic, road, and uh, everywhere. Let's say generally in Lagos State, we have all bad roads. Uh, the road is very bad, as you can see. It's very, very bad. We need a governor that should come and help us to do it. This road is very, is very bad. Unlike others, I used to pass when I'm going to. They get around this side, near landmark side. That road safe is too uh, bad. When I'm going with my car, I will see I'll be seeing big, big gallop, big, big water everywhere. So at least let something be done. Consequently, some commercial bus operators have hiked transport fares, thus inflicting more pains on commuters. Yes, where it's about to collect 15 and they've got 200 because of uh, the road is no good. We saw me to spend 200 or 300, I paid 500 naira before I reached here. Some residents appealed to the state government to attend to the alarming situation of the roads, not only because of long hours lost, but for the fear that criminals can take advantage of the situation. The road is bad, everybody knows that. The road is bad, but I can understand the government still trying to study the weather, maybe, you know, for rain. If rain subside, definitely they will do something, but for now, they won't do anything. It affects everybody, not even me, it's affecting the government themselves. It's affecting the functionality of the economy, everything. So we, even if you are the governor, you won't do a road when the weather is not good. You, because you fix it now, it gets spoiled again. But let's wait till the weather is good, maybe when the dry season comes and see what someone has to do for us. The state government on 13th October 2019 declared a state of emergency on various dilapidated highways in the state. With this, Lagosians are hopeful government to fix the roads as soon as possible to reduce the agony of commuters and motorists. Merci Emmanuel for Plus TV Africa.